Today, during episode 76 of Look What Just Found, we did pocket change. And this is how I, I, I don't know how long this is going to go on for, if I'm going to change the format. But for me, this is super duper cool because I go from one video to the next. Um, we just looked at non-penny pocket change. I separated it. and. The video was just getting too long, and then I do the um, the bonus feature at the end. Forget about it. It was never gonna. It would have been too long. And I have the pennies there for the next video. I don't know what I'm gonna do. If I, I don't think it's enough pennies for a full video, so I think I, what I'll do is I'll just add some pennies to it, and um, I'll add some pennies to it. Not many, just maybe like a half of a roll. It looks like it's about. A roll and a half so i'm thinking like i'll add a half a roll to it for the next video um but during episode 76 we did quarters nickels and dimes we didn't find much but we found one pretty cool dime error which i'm going to show you right now and and without further ado let's let's uh get into the abridged version of pockets change for episode 76. so this is what we went through. Uh, so I know you're going to watch or you already watched the uh, full episode. So this is a recap, right? That's basically what this is. It's a recap. Um, we didn't find any significant quarters. You know, can, can I miss something? Of course, I can always miss something. That's always a possibility. Um, I have to put my glasses on. I must say that during every video. But that's the way it is. We found some older nickels. We found two, two, two older nickels. Yeah, I think that's just where. If, if it was in better shape, you know, um, then maybe you, you would know if it's um, very light um, letters. But still, it's, these are nice older nickels. I'm happy with them. They're not silver or anything like that. But they're ours. How much is how much are they worth? They might be worth like a quarter or something like that, or fifty cents. And then we found two really nice. Um, believe it or not, these are off-center dimes. They misaligned on the front. That's a pretty big misalignment, and it's misaligned on the back. So I, I believe that makes it off-centered. What I do do sometimes when if uh, when a coin is off-centered, misaligned on both sides. I'll just check to see the check out the alignment, you know. Okay, so that one is not too bad. And this one's also misaligned significantly, you know, that's a pretty significant misalignment. And the reverse is yeah, yeah, it's also slightly misaligned, slightly. I'm not sure if that makes this one off center, but the misalignment was pretty significant. I thought I would keep it. Um, what is it worth? Um, I don't know, maybe both of these are worth a dollar ish. You know, if you collect dimes and uh, you like misaligned dimes, so I do have the, the eBay store, maybe I'll put those up in it. But the one that was really, really, we found one is I'm so I'm always happy that we find at least one thing that's significant, right? So 2000 uh, P Philadelphia. It's also misaligned. Even the rim, it almost has no rim on the right side. So this is also misaligned. Now, if you didn't watch the, the previous video, I'm going to leave it here for a second. And I'm going to see if you can see what I see. Do you see what I see? I love that song. I know you see it. It was very obvious. I'm going to zoom in a bit. Yes, and so it's not um, it's not a polished area, right? Because that that would that would be, you know, at first glance you might think it's polished, right? The shiny spots there on both sides, but it's actually all over. Oh, it, it's it's in other places. So what this is is, I think I think it's a die clash, right? 
someone could correct me. I, I didn't do the research on it. I think it's a die clash. There's an image, right? You can, uh, th those are leaves, I believe, on both sides of the flame. And then there's other stuff below. Let me go in a little further, see if we could. There you go. I'm not sure what the image is because it's not. I don't because it's, it's. I don't think it's the image of the um the dime. It's not like a, a reflection or like a move over or a double die. Sorry about sorry about that. Jeez, I'm too close. I guess. All right, we'll keep it there. I think for moving it around, I'll keep it right there. Sorry about that. Anyway, if you know what the image is, um, let me know in the comments below. You, you can see it also with, down below where the R I the Emplorius Umus. You can see also the, um, and I don't know exactly what caused this. Again, the only thing that comes to mind is calling it a die clash. I wonder if this is the reverse of the dime. It's something. I can't tell what it is exactly. This is the significant find of the uh, video. It's pretty cool. I've never seen anything like this before. I think I might have seen it on eBay or something like that, but I never found anything like this. It's kind of subtle, but it's uh, it's it's there. Okay, so that is the um, that is our abridged version. For episode 76 and um, I'm gonna do the pennies next and that'll be episode um, 67 and um, I'll see you on the next one